good old New Jersey. And we'll be looking at the top 10 public golf Joe courses Clyde. that you could play. But of course, Houston. we're hitting we all the along. states and we'll be looking at those public golf courses. So you want to subscribe. And our channel is looking pretty good in regards to content. We're really pumping it out there. So let's zoom in now to the top 10 public golf courses that you could play in the state of New Jersey. And number 10 is, it is a nine hole golf course, but you can play it. And it's a remarkable golf course nonetheless. The course was built in 2015, is a par 36, is 3,247 yards. And it's a fun nine hole golf course there, as you can see. So let's take a look now at the ninth golf course on this list that you could play. Now, number nine is a fantastic golf course, and it's just outside Philadelphia with views of Philadelphia River Winds Golf Tennis Club. The course is now owned by Ron Jaworski, but it was built in 2020. It stretches 7,086 yards, has a slope of 132 and a ranking of 73. Its season is from March to November and was designed by golf architect Ed Sheeran. Now that's now gonna put us at eight golf courses left to look at. And there's some incredible golf still on this list and courses that you probably have played because they're getting a little bit more familiar with the World Twilight Golfer. So let's zoom in now to Eagles Ridge Golf Club course that we haven't hit yet but I would take a look at because we're going to be keeping an eye on this golf course the footage online is not that great and we're looking forward to making updates to some of this footage now Eagle Ridge has three different nine hole golf courses and I believe you don't pick you just kind of show up and they decide for you it was built in 1999 it's 6,607 yards the two premier golf courses and is a slope of 132 and a ranking of 72.4 27 holes championship golf now let's zoom in to number seven another course on the list that we're going to be hitting and getting some better footage of the course is 6,810 yards it is a slope of 131 and a ranking of 71 Point one. It was built in 1999 by Stephen K. and Doug Smith. Of course, we're looking forward to updating some content on because that course looks fun. So we have six more golf courses left to look at. And we're getting better as we get into number six now, which is a fantastic 18-hole golf course here. Now, this course stretches 6,000, well... For the back tee, 7,094 yards. It has five different tee boxes to choose from. It was built in 1998 and has bent grass along with bent fairways. The course listed with numerous awards for public golf courses that you could play in the state of New Jersey. is a link style golf course, as you can see, but some picturesque backgrounds for the state of New Jersey, which doesn't have too many mountains. There's a lot to like about the five golf courses left on this list, some of which we've been to and have footage of because the footage is the best online. So let's now zoom in to number five on this list. There's two golf courses here, but we're going to go with the bay courses because that's more noticeable and has more history. It stretches 6,731 yards for par 71. It's going to spend you about a hundred dollar bill to play here but here's some of the footage of the course that we played gave a lot of good information on because it is a donald ross course built in 1914 so a ton of history pushing it over the edge to our number five golf course that you can play in the state of new jersey let's zoom out because we still have four more golf courses left to look at and there's a lot of golf in the state over 300 golf courses so it's getting hard but right down the street is balamore and this used to be a private golf course converted now into a public one and let's see how long that lasts the course that we only have the best footage of and we went to so we're going to show some of that stretches along 7200 yards is a part 72 and it is a slope of 130 built in 2001 bent grass and bent fair as you can see from our footage there's no hiding and just like that we have three more golf courses left to look at in the state of new jersey now this one is semi-private and but if you're a resort at the resort you can play it 
stretches a long 6,816 yards with a slope of 139 and a ranking of 73.5. Course has won absolute numerous awards, has bent grass fairways and greens, is open from March, but to the end of December. It's about 1992 it was built. It looked like it was right around that turn. Um, a, lot of golf a lot of golf courses being built in that area. This one is a fantastic one nonetheless. And now we're looking at just two more golf courses to choose from. It just gets better and better because these golf courses absolutely pack a punch. There's two more and we're going to be hitting these golf courses. That's why it's so important to subscribe as we update these videos located in west orange this municipal course had to make our list because this is it's got a lot of history and it's a fun course it's a par 71 that stretches 6611 yards it's a slope of 136 and a ranking of 72.1 course was built in 1925 by charles banks and a lot of water on this course believe it or not which makes it a fun golf course and you got to remember, we're updating these videos as we go, so it's probably not number two, but for this list, it's going to be number two. I like the history. I like the course where it's located. And in our defense, we probably need to have a buffer one, and number two is our best one. So if there's a course that we missed, put it at number two. All right, we have one more golf course. Let's get quickly into it. Number one on this list. And believe it or not, it's a giant link style golf course. Actually, a 27 holes of link style golf. Now, we're going to give it to the Lake and Ridge courses, both nine hole courses. And a fun one, nonetheless. Bowl, a par 72 there, stretching along 7,065 yards with a slope of 135 and a ranking of 736 course was built not too long ago in 2005 has bent grass bent fairways was designed by donna fair and has all the amenities top golf course every year in golf now nah, all of them so that's going to do it for our list you're going to want to keep a lookout for way more videos to come we're hitting all the golf courses across the world this is world twilight golfer one thing heads up